Warning, what you're about to see is extremely dangerous and should be tried by no one ever. No one, not even me. I should not be doing this in a garage, but I am, but I am. Da -da 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 hot dog electro Boys and girls, we find ourselves today in the laboratory, aka Mr. Lindley's garage. And what are we talking about? Hot dogs. Which way would a hot dog cook faster? If you connected hot dogs in series or if you connected hot dogs in parallel? And in front of me I have the very famous hot dog cooker now with these hot dogs we're very curious about which way will it cook faster if you connect them in like parallel light bulbs like series light bulbs which way will they actually cook faster is a great question that we have and honestly it's a question that's getting me honestly kind of hungry this is not cooked but yes it is Hot dogs are pre-cooked, so you can eat them cold to save time! Efficiency! Let's get to the cooking. Warning. What you are about to see in this video should be tried by no one. Ever. Not even the person doing this. However, this video was filmed by a trained professional taking all safety precautions necessary to ensure that it was done as safely as possible. A safe distance was kept at all times, and the circuits were run with the ability to quickly turn them off if necessary. Even so, this was dangerous, and you should watch it here, but do not try it. Seriously, do not try this. We are ready for hot dog cooker time. We're so pumped. What this is, you can see by the drawings, by the schematics here, this is the power source. The wire comes here to a junction, splits, and we'll put our hot dogs across here. The hot dogs acting as resistors. Mmm. Let's get underway. Now all we have to do is very delicately stab these on here. Now kids, brief warning. Uh, I would never, ever, ever do this ever, ever. I am a trained professional. And worst case, if something happens to me, who will miss me, JJ? <laughs> he will, that boy would be lost without me. So you see here on our series circuit, we have the power supply, the wire comes in, the electrons will go through the hot dog, through a wire across the back, through the hot dog, and then back out. We have another set of, of delicious hot dogs. There is a dog that lives in this house that is very excited by this experiment. Very, very excited. And I'm realizing now that screws were a poor choice because it is just ripping apart hot dog. It's just hot dog pieces literally everywhere. I'm probably gonna have to record over my voice because I don't know how well this audio is actually recording. And here at the parallel C again, split junction, boom, and back. Boys and girls, before we start, this is very don't do this ever! Ever, ever, never do this! Okay! Which will cook faster? Will it be the series hot dog or the parallel ones? Make your predictions now! Do you know what time it is? It's hot dog o'clock. Okay. Hot dogs are ready. We are ready. Oh god. I don't know if you can see, boys and girls, the steam! Look at these parallel hot dogs. By the series ones, what's even going on with them? Is it nothing? Oh, these, oh, these are getting drippy. Oh, this is so drippy. This is why I put down plastic.
And the serious hot dogs. Still nothing. Cook, my beauties, cook! Oof. This is making a lot more smoke than I really wanted it to originally. Oof. Okay, we're going to unplug the parallel hot dogs. So I've unplugged the parallel hot dogs and you can see now that they're unplugged just now. The series hot dogs are just barely beginning to smoke. Just barely. Just barely. So I will sort of leave that. Okay, the series ones, if you see, they're just a little sweaty. I don't know how well you can see that. They're just a little bit sweaty. So I think it's I think it's time to pull the plug. Now it's time for my favorite part! Eating the hot dogs! <laughs> and now, ladies and gentlemen. It's time for arguably the most important part, the taste test. Let's start with the parallel hot dogs. Now, if you look very carefully, so if you look, if we look very carefully, that's the part that was on the screw. I am definitely not going to eat that part. But the other part here, let's see. It is very, very little bit of screw on that still. <laughs> That's gross. You can see how cooked this hot dog is. So let's give it the old taste a mm. Just like mom used to make. Mm. Delicious. Let's try the series hot dogs. Delicately cutting. Now you can see how significantly less this one is cooked and shriveled up. So much less cooked! So much less of the cook. If I try, can I get side by side pieces? I'm going to have to touch it then. I prefer not to touch the hot dogs. Okay, that doesn't. Okay, this is. I am very struggling. So you can see here. This is the series and this is the parallel. So let's let's try a taste of the series. Mm. Yes, Uncle Um would approve. Mm -hmm. Now I'm a parallel man myself because the parallel hot dogs are just cooked a little bit more. I think they're a bit more delicious. Personal opinion. Personal opinion. But let's let's check in with the expert. First up, parallel hot dog. Leave it. Hey. Okay. How was that, Quinn? Was it scrum diddly umptious? Now it's time for the series hot dog. Time for the series hot dog. <laughs> Okay, you can have it. Good girl, Quinn. Good girl. Was that delicious? Sit. You can see the clear difference in this parallel hot dog right here. You can see how it's split open, but yet the series hot dog did not. Why would the parallel hot dogs cook faster than the series ones? An excellent question. Can you figure it out? Now, more clips of Quinn. Would you like some more hot dog? Pa? Pa? Oh, give me, give me, oh, gee. you're very about the hot dogs right now. That's, is there another piece here that's not covered in a nail? Are you ready? I heard you're the champion. Can you catch? Such a good catch! From Quinn. 
This hot dog. Sit. No, sit. I don't want it, but do you want it? Hot dog fingers. <laughs>